Hi, this is Mike from the Mobile Fanatics. Today I have the Nokia N9. Um, I'm going to show you the multitasking. I'm going to open up some applications and we'll see how much it could handle. Um, as you can see right now, nothing is open yet. So I'll go ahead and go to my app list and we'll get started. I'll start with the calculator. Put that in the background. We'll launch the gallery application. Alright, put that in the background. Get the music player launched. Okay, that's up now. And we'll get um, the Facebook application launched. We'll launch my RSS feeds and we'll get a feed open. Okay, we'll go ahead and open the web page. Well, that's opening. We'll open up um, the calendar app. Let's take a quick look at what we have open. So here are live tiles of what our uh, applications are open. Um, the multitasking panel. So right now I got four six five six seven we'll open up messaging email let's get an email in view okay We'll open AccuWeather. And let's start with one more. We'll get um, the Twitter app running. So while that loads, we'll go ahead and check out what we have going on in the multitasking panel. Um, right now as you can see there's a lot here to list you could pinch and it'll shrink down the size of the live tiles so here we have Twitter AccuWeather uh, and email right here messaging the calendar a website the RSS feed from the website I opened Facebook app, music player, and calculator and gallery. So we'll count that out. That's 9, 10, 11. So right now we got 11 apps open. We'll go through. Right now it's refreshing. There we go. The Twitter app's refreshed. So that's working nice and fast. Go to my people that tweet it to me. Then we'll go ahead and test out another app. Here's a weather app. We'll go to hourly. We'll go to maps. Okay, so that's working good. Lifestyle. All within the AccuWeather app. We'll check out the email I was looking at. Very responsive. I'll go back to my inbox, scroll through. All messages. No issues here. Go back, calendar. Okay, all the views work. I can add a new entry. Cancel. The web browser. Um, let's see, let's zoom in. Actually, it just, yeah, there we go. Zoom, zoom in. Works pretty fast. Scrolling up and down the page. This is with 11 apps still open. We'll get out of it. Go to Facebook. Um, I'll check if I have any new notifications. 
nothing yet it would show down here if I had a new notification go to my news feed right now it's updating there it's updated everything runs pretty smooth then we'll head to I already showed you Twitter messaging is right there music player I got about 16 gigabytes worth of songs on here so we'll go ahead and play something real quick oh yep there it was as you can see it's very responsive okay pause that calculator alright so we still have 11 apps open let's keep going uh, we'll go ahead and scroll down the list we'll open AP mobile very cool application uh, made specially for the N9 now pay attention here where we got 12 up apps open now we're gonna make sure that none crash on us so we'll count up every now and then um, we'll go ahead and get one of these open Okay, here's the article. We could scroll up and down to read the article or left and right to go to another article. As you can see, no delay here. Put this in the background. Okay, we got 12 apps open. Let's keep it going. Go back to the menu. We'll open the timer. The timer will run in the background. hit play okay I'll show you right now it's actually running live in the background see the seconds right there going on the multitasking panel so these uh, pan uh, tiles they're all live tiles live multitasking going on let's open a heavier app we'll open maps this takes um, about five seconds to completely load Okay, we got it loaded up. Finding the location. Okay. Zoom in. Scroll around. Pinch to zoom. Let's zoom in real close. Let's see if anything's crashed with the maps running in the background. We had 12 open before, now we should have 13, so there's 9. 10, 11, 12, 13. Oh, there's 14 open. All right, so we got 14 running. Let's speed things up a little bit. We'll go ahead and launch the videos. Now I'm expecting something to start crashing here with 14 apps open. Let's get something playing. These um, came pre-installed on the phone. Okay. So the video is playing. It's a little bit choppy as you can see. There we go. The cool thing about videos, if you want to um, go to another panel, it'll keep playing when you're scrolling side to side. So as you can see right there, it's still playing in the background. Go from this side, from the top. This phone is extremely powerful. So we'll hide it, go to multitasking, and I think that noise is something crashing that you just heard. So we had 14, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So we're still running pretty good. Um, again, we're coming up on 10 minutes here on this video, so I'll get things speeding up. We'll go ahead and run... Um, Force Quick, which is a Foursquare application free found in the Nokia store. I think I clicked on it. it. Might be starting to lag here. Let's do it again. Okay, there it goes. So the phone is starting to slow up a bit, but the application, once it got loaded, everything loaded up quick. I could go ahead and check in. Uh, we'll check in right here. 
Catella Deli, check in. The application's running fast, as you can see. Okay. Put it in the background. Next up, I'm going to load a game. So we got three, we got 12, or I'm sorry, we got nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 apps running. I'll load Angry Birds, which I've said it before, but I'm expecting this to kill it. So we'll load Angry Birds. This one's taking a little bit of time to load. Expected with everything that's running in the background. Okay. This game looks great on the N9 screen, by the way. We'll go ahead and hit play. We'll start here. And here we go. So we'll scroll around. Zoom in and out. No delay here. Go down to our birds. Oops, I shot one backwards. Let's do it again. Let's see what I'm doing here. Launch it up. So while that's running in the background, we'll hide it real quick. Now I'm trying to hide it. Swipe from the side to hide it. And it's not being responsive, so I'm thinking maybe the phone is finally locked up. Let's see if it could catch up with itself. Let me lock it real quick, see if it's responsive at all. Nope. So right here on the side, you'll see the lock button. Push the lock, nothing happens. It's supposed to go blank. So it looks like I've actually locked up the Nokia N9 after running about 15 to 16 apps. Um, it could do a lot more if you're just running the smaller system apps. I've easily gotten it up to 30, but um, if you're starting to run maps, web browser, video, music player, calendar, Angry Birds, um, AP mobile application, RSS feeds, email, messaging, calculator, Foursquare app, that's everything that's running right now. Then you're going to start having some issues like we see right here. Um, the phone's unresponsive. I think I'm going to have to shut down the phone. I'll hold it down for five seconds. And goodbye. Okay, so that's the Nokia N9 multitasking torture test. Thanks for watching and be sure to visit us at themobilefanatics.com.